Ah, good day. It's uh, Dave the Enlightened Plumber here uh, with today's quote. So, you must have long-range goals to keep you from being frustrated by your short-term failures. All right. You must have long-range goals to keep you from being frustrated by your short-term failures. And this is from Charles C. Noble. And uh, let's, uh, let's dive right into this. Okay. Um, okay, so long-range goals. Perfect. Uh, we want to, to have our dreams and goals that I've talked about a lot. So a long-range uh, goal is obviously something that is not today, not tomorrow. This could be a month from now, could be three months from now, next year, five years, ten years, whatever, right? We're all used to having these forecasts for businesses. We, we're all like, you know, we all grow up with saying, oh, what would you like to be when you grow up? Well, that's, you know, if you're 10 years old and you're looking at what I want to be when I say I'm 25 or 30, that's a long-term goal, right? long-range forecast of, of what's coming up. And um, so you have to have those deep, buried in your head here. You've got to keep a, a focus on what you're wanting out of life, right? What you want to do for yourself. And it could be for yourself. It could be for others. So you could have a long range forecast of say, um, hey, I'm going to open up a, uh, a store or a charity or um, set up a foundation, something like that, say in three to five years to help homeless people or help underprivileged or help uh, animals in need. Um, or any such things, right? Um, so you can have um, those long-range forecasts, and that's what you want to do. You want to kind of keep those things in mind. And having a, a, a vision that's way off into the future um, helps you get over those little hurdles. Because if it if it's something that, that, that has a heart meaning for you and means something a lot, then, you know, should you uh, end up having some short-term issues so you know that could be cash flow right that's quite a common one um, it could be that there's partners you're working with that that lose interest and so they don't end up doing what they're supposed to do or something like that all these things are short-term goals uh, or short-term failures as they talked about now obviously we're also aware that a failure is not a failure it's only feedback and sometimes it's good Generally, the way the universe will work is that your feedback or your failure in the short term is really annoying, can be devastating, can be horrible, horrendous, whatever, or it could be just mildly annoying. Any situation like that, whatever it is, is leading you to future betterment, future good. So you have to lose something. You have to have some struggle. You have to hit some obstacle to allow you to get to where you need to be for future growth. So with that, uh, you must have long, long range goals to keep you from being frustrated by your short term failures. And that's from Charles D. Noble. So with that, have yourselves a great day.